Good day, folks! This is me, Mike Harib, welcoming you back to the return of scripted episodes. It's only this time, and I'll be back to vlogging. I, 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 we, I, we ain't going to fuck up our time. I have an album and some stuff to sell, so fuck off. I ain't got time for shit. Just kidding. <laughs> so, who wants me to do the Ray William Johnson? Hey, hey, why did the music stop? I'm serious. I'm serious. I, I, I'm gonna do some kind of a equals five about music videos now. As boring as it sounds, I, I think it's about time I do what people tell me to do for once. And you're probably gonna get bored because these videos aren't even viral. What I'm doing is for the sake of comedy only. These days, everyone just wants to have some fun. And until the watch of the fall is out, I'm serving you guys a good deal of lots. So, are you ready for this? That's right, me neither. First stop is a video for a third generation oriental metal band. Check this out. Yes, I know, it sounds as if Orphaned Land and the typical Egyptian Mao Wheel band had sex and this was the result. I can't I can even begin to comprehend how this mix happened. But I'll get out on a limb here and simply say this band kicked ass sometime, but then, you know, worsens happened. But why? Why? You guys had one job! One fucking job and it was to live out a whole year! The next thing you know, BAM! The rhythm section leaves and makes a new band. I'm not one to blame, but I guess if the family bond was a bit stronger, Mr. A knocks over the- Yes, it's... That, it's the same hairstyle, same stuff, probably separated at birth. So if that happened, we wouldn't have seen worsens. As a matter of fact, I say, go Tari Magani and go worsens. I'm not gonna take a side here because everyone is doing what they like and fact is, I'm all for fucking pursuing what they like. Hey, where was I going with this again? Too bad they didn't continue. They really had the media around. Those pesky elitist metalheads hate their success. The movie is very good and this is a new one and we have to help them support and all that. والحفلات دي بتبقى ممتازه ويا ريت الناس تيجي اكتر وتسمع الكلام ده يو لايك ذات دونت دو سكو اوكي ذات واز رونج ذس ذس جايز اون ماي فيسبوك هي هي يور اون تي في اي كانت ايفن سي ام توتالي اوكي وذ تي ام سبلينج اي مين جايز ذا سكسس ذا نيو تيست واي نيكست اب بيكوز اي ثينك ام دون ام بانشينج ماي باديز بيست لاك تو اول اوف يو لاف يو ذس وان ام نوت ريلي براود اوف Fucking chromatic! I am not leaving until I come up with an explanation for this. For some reason, I'm getting nauseous about this. Uh, guitarist decides to call up a freaking art studio so they can capture him, improvising on no scale at all if it's not the infamous chromatic scale. Seriously? Shredding on no scale is a thing now? Who the hell do you think you are, Mick Thompson? With all due respect to some people who thought I was being too harsh on the kid, you guys are right, but if anything, somebody has to tell him that this is wrong. And it's not me. I don't even know him. I'm only here to judge, I don't give advice, because I'm the one who the latest and you will pay <laughs> this joke is over. Do I, if you're seeing this, stop. Learn some scales. Over. Third one's a bit, you know, not metal. I just feel like bashing people now. The question now is, is this a thing? Sahbi, the one I bought. 
تبرى اخويا من اب تاني وام تانية في اي موقف واي زنقة لو عزت جنبي بلاقي في ثانية فرقة واحدة وجم واحد وفي كل حاجة اصحاب بجد انا وهو على الغريب وعلى ابن عمي Where's fucking minutes of my life? You know, aside from the very obvious ripoff of One Direction, I can say there's a lot of money wasted on production and most probably cosmetics. Cause you know, makeup. They look too groomed for three young men and uh, boys. Has, has the name boy band. Boy band, huh? But when you grow up, what's, what's it gonna be? Men band? I mean, that would possibly happen once you start doing something original. Talk about free baby having stepbrothers who will never grow up. Ripoffs are not successful, and this just proves my point so bad it's going to have sex with my point from too much proving. Okay, that sex joke wasn't bad. Did I mention that I'm starting to point out to funny people I know that they're so good they should start being stand-up comedians? I mean, I said that already to Midwinter's very own Alfred. Like, he has the makings of a stand-up comedian, even the physique of a stand-up comedian. <coughs> Sorry, who am I to say that? I, I, have, I have a bad sense of humor. BRB, gonna shoot myself in the dick. So, since I'm dickless now, let's watch something to bring back my manhood. What do we have here? No, I guess my dick's back. Thank you very much. Go fuck yourself. What is this? This thing, it, it, the person has the audacity and the nerve to call this the pride of our national production. Suck me sideways. Where's the pride? Where is the pride? If this was what metal looked like back in the first generation, then man, am I happy to be a newbie. This guy fucking meows in a, a metal music video and calls it drawing. In fact, even though I honestly have no idea what the lyrics are about, but the title says it all, Leo in a cage. Okay, so you made a whole song with a music video about a mammal with a mane that has helped captive. Interesting. Fuck you! Metal was never about this. This is not metal. It sounds more Egyptian crappy pop. Metal doesn't have to relate to this just because you have a f f f fucking Jackson Dinky! In fact, I'll just get my half brother to talk about this. So you brought me all the way from fucking Burger Girl Mike to say this? I mean, do you have the, any idea of the cringe? The cringe, Mike? Do it! I wish I had been aborted before I see this kind of shit. You monkey piss flap! <sighs> Alright, I'll just ease this up for myself and choose a non Egyptian video for the last one. Check this out. Oh god! Holy shit! Holy shit, is that a lady doing this? Well, if you hadn't known yet, Simone Employers had the guts, literally, to do these vocals. I don't want to overreact, but she can probably surpass fucking corpse grinder. The lyrical theme is not one I'd enjoy either, talking about hardcore rape and organ eating. It's confirmed! Some Plymers is an undercover zombie- Never mind. This is by far the most impressive kind of female vocals I've seen. Female guttural vocals. I mean, listen to that! Ladies and gentlemen, we have witnessed an undercover zombie- uh, we have witnessed women taking their vocals to a new level. What's next? Women drumming? Oh, that happened already. That's all for today. I will be back soon with another video. If you like this, let me know. And if you don't like it, I definitely want to hear what you think about this. The links for every video are in the description below. Long live crap comedy! Peace!